This video will cover categorizing your assets with tags in Tenable.io. The goal of this video is to make it easier for you to filter on assets based upon a logical grouping that maps to your organizational landscape. There are a couple of different ways to create tags. The first way I'll show you is by filtering on assets in the Assets Workbench. So if we click on Assets on the left-hand side under our workbench, we can see all of the assets that we've discovered in Tenable.io. Currently, there are 513 available assets. If we click the advanced link and create a filter for a specific IP address range, we'll be able to narrow the results. So we've narrowed our results down to 135 assets from 513. Now, we can select all of these assets and apply a bulk tag. After we've selected all of the assets, we can click the Add Tags button. From here, we have to create a category and also create a value. So the top level category that I'll create will simply be called Network Ranges. And for the value, we can call this our 10 network. You can see here that the tags to be added will have a category of network ranges and a value of 10 network. When we click the Add button, all of those assets will now be tagged accordingly. Next, let's create a dynamic asset tag. To do this, first go to Settings, then click on Tags from the left-hand menu. You can see the tag that we previously created with a category of network ranges and the value of 10 network. Next, we'll create a new tag. For the category, let's create a new category called Operating Systems. For the tag value, which is optional, we'll choose Windows. You can also choose a category description and a value description if you'd like to be more verbose in naming. Next, we can check the box to apply automatically with rules. Since this tag will filter on only Windows operating systems, we'll choose Operating System from the filter list. In the Matching section, we'll choose Contains. And for the text, we'll type Windows. Next, we'll click the Create button. Now we have a dynamic tag with a category of operating systems and a value of Windows. This tag will automatically be applied to any new asset that has been identified as a Windows system. Next, we can repeat the process for our Linux systems. We'll create a new tag, select our existing category for operating systems, and create a new value for Linux. Again, we'll click Apply Automatically with Rules, go down to our Operating System Filter, set Contains and a value of Linux, and click Create. To use these tags, you can go back to the Dashboards and click on the Assets Workbench. If we click on our Advanced Filter, we can now see that these tags populate the list of available filters at the bottom. We can choose to filter on our operating system tag that contains the value Windows.